so we're here at the Arm booth. We're checking out the Arm Alinea Studio right here. And uh, so, hi. So, who are you? Hi, my name is Ross, and I lead Arm's HPC Tools Engineering Team. So, uh, what is the Arm Alinea Studio? So, the Arm Alinea Studio. And we have a demo up here on the stand. Is it's, it's, uh, it's the big culmination of efforts um, bringing together our compilers and libraries for ARM with the debuggers and profiling tools that we acquired from a company called Alinea about 12 months ago. Uh, we released this last week and really the key message here is we are ready for people to deploy on ARM. So what, is, what did Alinea do? So Alinea is a company, um, they produce cross-platform tools for um, Intel, uh, Nvidia, for IBM, for ARM, and their tools are called DDT, Map and Performance Reports, which is a debugger, a profiler. And as ARM, we're continuing to produce the cross-platform tools as well. Um, we are also, whilst we're here pointing at our commercial tools, we're also very invested in the open source community as well. So uh, can, we, can we see the tool, how it looks like? What does it do? We can. So this is up here. And it's running on an ARM uh, desktop. This is running on ARM desktop. Let me yeah, check this, this thing here. Right here. It's an Inventec 64-bit uh, Thunder X workstation. Yes, yeah, so it's the Cavium Thunder X1. And there's been a lot of news yeah. on the Cavium Thunder X2 so far yeah. at SC. So on the screen here, you can see ARM DDT, which is a debugger. Um, this is actually a bit of code here where something's broken. So you can use the debugger to step through uh, and actually fix the problem. Uh, so um, so it's, it's tools, right? And it's the main announcement at the, this event. Uh, ARM has been announcing some tools, right? Right, so and this is one of them. from an ARM perspective, in terms of what we've done, yes, this is, this is our big announcement, is that we have in the past week released the ARM Alinea Studio, which is what we promised to do, which again is bringing together the, the compiler, the library, and making it work well with the debug. Can we see what it says the in profile here? Tool. Yeah, sure. So what's talking about? So you can see the key fixes coming out here, right? We've got the C++ compiler based on LVM, where we upstream things back to the community. We've got a Fortran compiler. You know, a lot of HPC codes are still written in Fortran. We've got the performance libraries. Oh, yeah, I keep mentioning the, the debugger and the profile tool as well. So, uh, this is uh, tools that the community has been looking forward to? Yeah, absolutely. It's what people, the market's demanding. Commercially supported tools and open source tools. And in terms of the linear tools, prior to, uh, to the ARM acquisition, you'll find that they're I'm on successful. You know, a large majority of the world's top supercomputers. So absolutely, we're bringing together everything people need to, uh, to deploy on ARM. Uh, what is, what's going on over here? Right, so this is a, an open source program called Paraview, which allows you to visualize uh, models. So what, what this demonstrates nicely is an end-to-end, -end, taking some code, compiling it with the ARM compiler, uh, running open phone to do the modeling, and then running Paraview as well, to sort of compile for ARM. So it's, uh, it looks fun. It's running on the tool. But what kind of tool? So this is using the compiler that we have to actually get the tool running. So this isn't an ARM tool you're looking at. It's just the ARM tools have been used to, to get it up and running. Uh, so supercomputing in ARM is going to be a big feature, right? ARM wants to have a big role in supercomputing. That's the plan. And the, uh, all these people that are going to develop for that are going to be using these tools? I believe they'll be using a combination of our tools and then tools by other third parties as well. And actually, that's what we want, right? We want a healthy ecosystem where it's not just ARM developing the tools. So I'm not going to start listing all the vendors, but there's many of them are here, obviously, with their own compilers as well. And in fact, if you go, if you actually do want to secure, um, just the word I'm looking for, part of the, uh, the booth here, you can see we've got Fujitsu and, and Cavium as well on the, uh, on the booth. Dem with other you know, ARM-related demonstrations.